everyone and welcome to the fourth of seven top tips on our way to the qualification round in GT Academy. This one is all about analysing your lap, working out what you need to do to get the best lap you possibly can and you've got to be able to work that out on your own before it works everywhere else. So this is sort of bring, coming on from top tip number three which is practicing technique. Uh, so essentially what you would want to do is approach a given combo um, so we'll talk about the GTR at Bathurst um, and Sector 1 is a really good example. So I approach this Sector 1 after I've done a few laps I think right okay how can I improve on this sector. So I may compare myself to rank 1, rank 2, rank 3, see what they're doing and go hmm okay they're doing it like this. Uh, and then I may try and be aggressive. This is what I did for this, this car. I tried to be really aggressive turning quite early to, in order to get a really quick exit. Didn't work out so well because I kept hitting the curb slightly weight was making it more unstable on the exit. That's critically analysing the, that corner straight away. So I think, right, okay, the aggression works, but the weight transfer doesn't. Let's break it a little bit later. Let's turn it in later, avoid hitting the curb, and accelerate out. Boom. Worked out a treat, worked out a very good consistent line, and that meant I could get really good consistent first sectors. Voila, I critically analysed that first corner, which gave me a good first sector time, and then I can build on that and go to the next corner and go right okay how are they doing it let's try a few things let's try a few techniques okay this worked this didn't work this didn't work I'll try the one that always works that will give me a better corner for say corner two right let's go on to corner three if you can critically analyze your entire lap work out what you need to do for each corner when you come to watch guides and stuff you can be like oh, okay yeah I see how that's explained now I understand that I'll apply that technique or that that sort of standard of acceleration braking whatever and I'll see where that gets me so if you can analyze your lap if you can't learn to try and do it and this round three is a good example to try and learn how to do it with sector one once you know how to do it you'll be able to get quicker and quicker with the lap times because you can in instantly think about the corner so that's my top tip learn how to analyze your lap or analyze your lap as best as you can we'll see you at tip number five